Where am I? Hello? This doesn't feel like Crossroads. What happened? It's kind of like- Hey, there's a button! Oh! 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 We fell at the dungeon, but that means... Shoot! I left my armor at the entrance! But... Where is everyone? Yara? Max? Amber? Anyone? Am I... All alone? No way, no. That can't be right. We fell together. We've got to be here! But there's not really a point in looking for them now. The sun's already going down. Alright. I think the best plan of action would be to make a base. Probably get some tools, too. Then we can go look for everyone. Yeah. Alright. Let's do it. Hello, little piggy. Yeah. Copper. Oh, there's creeper feet! There's creeper toes! Oh no! I guess we're gonna go this way then! Oh, there's another cave! Oh, it's a lush cave! I missed my other right! Nice! There? Ah! And now, behold, the diamond. <gasps> There's more diamonds! Okay, now, let's get back to the surface. Okay, safely back up in the overworld. Now, I think it would be a good time to set up a camp. But we're gonna need some resources first. Here, sheepy, 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 sheepies. I've got some wood. I've got some wool. I think we're ready to build. Let's do some time lapsing. Welcome all to my humble abode. Let me show you around the place. First, we've got the tent, of course, which is where I sleep and keep my goodies. Though we are running low on food, which is uh, not very uh, beneficial. But I've got a plan for that, don't you worry, but we'll get to that in just a second. Uh, next we have our sheepy friends. I thought they could use a little bit of a nicer home other than just a little hole in the ground, which is what they were in for a second, I won't lie. But they are much more cozy now. Isn't that right? Um, sheep. I've got an area here where we can cook some food if we'd like, or if we want to save coal, we can use the campfire. And I set up a bulletin board in case we want to make a list of things to do. I don't know how much stuff we would want to do. I think the plan is pretty straightforward that we have to, you know, uh, find our friends. Actually, wait, I can find them. Aha, here we go. Step one, get food. I'm hungry. And there's no point going on an adventure on an empty stomach. Step two, find friends. Seems pretty straightforward. And now the board isn't entirely pointless. Tie everything together. I added some custom birch trees and a single custom oak tree. 
just because without them, the base looks kind of bland, very empty. So I thought a little foliage could do it some good and it did. So I think we did a good job at accomplishing this goal. Okay, but now let us make it to step one, except wait, step one was kind of building a base and getting resources. So this could be step two. Uh, the board is failing. No! Okay, let's do step one. Let's get some food. So here's what I had in mind for how we're gonna do this. Boat. Fishing rod. We are gonna go fishing. I can't really say I've done this before. I mean, I have gone fishing, but never really, like, for early game food. I, we're completely surrounded by ocean. We are literally stranded on an island. And it's not a very easy one to traverse. Let's just hop in our boat. And let's see what one fishing rod will do us. I have returned back from my fishing adventures and take a look at this. Oh my gosh, the amount of loot I have gotten. I have gotten, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten saddles and oh my gosh. Hello? Um, uh, uh, that's, that's dangerous, buddy. You good? Um, as I was saying though, yeah, I got a lot of goods from this and a lot of fish. I've already been cooking these up, so I think we're good to go on food for a while. I got some good books too. Nothing like crazy, but maybe something I'll be able to use in the future. And look at this. I defeated a drowned and I think I got these actually from two separate occasions, but now I have a trident. I mean, they're kind of useless without enchants, but that's okay. I mean, with this kind of luck, maybe we'll eventually get some? I don't know, but okay, dude, what is your problem? Do you have anything good in here? Oh my gosh. This guy sells shulker shells? And chorus flowers? Oh my gosh! Yo! What? That's insane! How do I... A skew and a phantom membrane. I ha have none of those, but... Oh my gosh. Dude, you are like special. I've never gotten a wandering trader to sell those. And and chorus flowers nonetheless. Like, can I like put you in a box? I think that these spawn after a while, which is kind of sad, but... Wait, and he sells endstone! Hold on a sec, hold on a second. Okay, let's see. Uh, I have a stack of cobblestone I can give you for that. So you want... Wow. Oh, what a deal. And chorus flower. I think... I think there's some lily of the valley around here somewhere. Yep, right here. Here we go. Awesome. Alright, where'd he go? Hello there, my friend. Oh, come back. So if I just give you that, will you get more? Ooh, let me go see if I can find some more Lily of the Valley. I think Lily of the Valley mainly spawn in birch forests, which it's kind of convenient that we happen to be living in one. Let's see if we can find any more. Like this kind of cuts into a dark oak. Well, there's one birch tree. Does it start back up again over here? Oh, is this an ocean ruin? Oh, I've never seen one spawn up on land before. I mean, like, I have, but not this far up. This feels different. What's in here? What's this? Mysterious book? I have never seen anything like this before. First the wandering traitor, and, and now this? Does this have anything written here? The one who finds this book, the writing on these pages contains all of the knowledge I have collected throughout my studies of alchemy. Use it wisely. Alchemy? What? Well, anyways, it does not seem like there's any lily of the valley here. Nope, I am not seeing any more. I think I've done pretty much a full rotation of the island and now, Oh, well, dang it. But I mean, at least we got one. At least we got like a single one because I think we can grow that with the end stone. We can place it there and then we can get more. So it kind of works out. 
Mr. Trader? Did he despawn? Oh my gosh. Shoot. Well, I mean, maybe we'll find another one one day. Hmm. First the trader, then this book. Alchemy. The process of taking matter in one state and pushing it to become something greater. However, it is not something that can be achieved overnight. One must start out simple. Chapter 1. Simple mixes. It gives instructions on how to make things. Interesting. I mean, maybe that's something we'll have to look into later. Then we still have to find our friends, too. Uh, but you know what? Between all this building, and fishing, and grinding... Oh my gosh, it's, it takes a lot out of you. So, you know what? I think I'm gonna call it a wrap. Next episode, we will definitely go looking for our friends. And maybe we'll look into what this book has to say, too. <laughs> So I guess this is the part of the video where I say thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!